Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we're gonna try to finish up Bling Bling Bear. We only have his arms and legs and it can't possibly take that long, right? <laughs> so we think. So we're gonna go ahead and finish up Bling Bling Bear today. I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. And we're just gonna jump right on into it. So let's get started.
So as you saw, we finished Bling Bling Bear. I broke a nail, not happy about it. We're not gonna talk about it. Um, so again, the products that I used, one dot, not a lot craft glue, which seems to do really good. Um, I actually put a layer over the entire bear, let them dry, like I left the house for a while, let them dry and came back. So that is the glue that I used. And of course I will link it down below. We have the rhinestones that were given to us and I have a ton of rhinestones left over. I even have a couple of the little ones left over. And here it is, the grand finale. Bling bling bear, look at Now I didn't do his feet because he needs to stand up. So like, I didn't think doing his feet, he would be able to stand up. So we did all the rest of them. Isn't he cute? I love him. So there you have it. That project was a little time consuming. Uh, the le Each arm took me an hour. So that's one, two hours. And then the legs took me about an hour as well. So I wasn't expecting it to take so long, but it is what it is. So yeah, so Bling Bling Bear is done. And I don't feel like any of the diamonds are gonna fall off or anything. I might spray him with a little bit of Patricia Nemox, uh, the glue or the spray adhesive that I use for my diamond paintings to seal them. But other than that, he is completely done. And I'm super happy with it. So if you yourself would like to do a bling bling bear, I just did a complete beginning to end with you. Uh, I will have all four parts of this series up in the eye. So thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave those down in the comment section below, and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as I possibly can. But with that said, folks, I got to get out of here. Thank you again so much for watching. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I decide to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. With that said, folks, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you that it's hard out here in these crafty streets. Please stay safe. Wear your mask. Wash your hands. Don't touch your face out in public. Keep your six feet and always try. Be kind. Be courteous. Be cool. Bye, guys.